when you're running Windows 7 and you have Outlook permanently pinned to the taskbar like it is here, it's really easy to have Windows automatically load Outlook in its minimized state every time you log on to your machine. So you can see here that when I when you when you normally open it, it loads up like that and loads up, you know, in a normal window or full size screen, whatever you got it set to. And I want this to be minimized so that it minimizes it down to the right hand side there. So to do this, click on the start menu. We're going to go to all programs, Microsoft Office, and now find your copy of Outlook, right click, left click on the properties, then change the run to minimized. And we'll click OK on that one. Just want to check that it hasn't uh, changed this one at the same time. So right click on the icon there, right click on Microsoft Outlook there and go into that properties. Now we see this one's running in normal window, so that's fine. Yeah, that's running normally. And if we go back to all programs, Microsoft Office, go back to Outlook. And this one now starts minimize, so that's starting down here. Okay, that's all looking good. Now all we've got to do now is copy that over to our start our startup folder. So go back into it, go to Microsoft Office, right click on your Outlook, copy that shortcut now, the one that's minimized, go down to your startup folder, which will be there. So right click, go into explore, which brings up, up to here. So you can see we're in our startup folder here. So you can right click, paste it in there. And now you have a lovely little shortcut that should work every time you log on. So now if we just check that's working okay, go back to our startup folder. Click on that one. Yep, sure enough, it's started it up and it's all minimized. So that should be good to go. Next time you log into your machine, that should load up in the tray to there with no annoying uh, interface that you have to close down every time you switch your machine. Okay, thanks for watching. I hope you found this helpful.